Welcome everyone to a new tactics video on my channel. My name is Mark and in this video I'm going to show you the best way to play with the German club RB Leipzig. All in my opinion of course based on my own playstyle at this moment in FC24. This was a really really big favorite team of mine in FIFA last few years uh, because they always have some fast players, technical players, dribblers and yeah in this video we're going to see if they still got it and if it's gonna be still one of my favorite teams especially if you're looking at the four star teams it's a four and a half star team at the moment uh so let's find out but before i begin i would really like you to ask a favor drop a like under the video if you think i deserved it uh, it will be really helpful for me and my channel to grow and if you're new to the channel and want to find your way back really easy make sure that you are subscribed with notifications on then we also have two sponsors. The first one is gogleshop.cc. It's a website where you can order jerseys and kits from clubs and uh, international teams all around the world. The quality is really, really good. It's just the same like the real ones, but it's way, way cheaper. Check out the website. And if you want to order one, then use discount code MARK for 12% extra off. And we also have Iniba, that is the go-to place. If you wanna buy new games uh, or maybe older games, they all have, yeah, I think almost all games they have. And also some gift cards. And if you're playing Ultimate Team, you can also buy FIFA points over there. So check it out, links are in the description. All right, we're going to the formation. It's the 4-2-3-1 narrow formation. Uh, Gulacki is the goalkeeper. He is not in there by standard because he is injured for a long time. And uh, Blaswic is in the goal, but you can, of course, select Gulacki. He's a better goalkeeper, uh, of course. Uh, I'm using Simakan as the right defender. Uh, Klosterman as the centre-back. Lu Keba as a center back and Raum as the left defender. Uh, you can also switch these two guys, but I really like to have Klosterman in the center because he is a bit faster and yeah, he has low medium work rates. Um, and on the right side, that can be a really, yeah, a bit thing. Um, and yeah, also, um, yeah. He feels better for me as a center back than as a right defender. So I'm using him, especially if you're playing against fast strikers, then it's really nice to have Klosterman in the center. But if you want, you can switch them, of course. Um, then we have Schlager and Kampel as the central defensive midfielders. Uh, Simons is on the right side. Olmo is central one. Openda is on the left side. And Werner is my striker. And then I already know what uh, questions are coming why are you using openda on the left side well that's because uh he is really really fast and i'm going to show you later in the tactics why i'm using him on this side but he also has the finesse shot and the trivela so if you are cutting inside with this guy you can do a finesse shot if you're not cutting inside but just shooting you can use a trivela shot so it's really great player to have on this side of the field it's a really great weapon and for some reason i always liked werner in this game he feels so quick and yeah he also has the rapid and the quick step so that's even helping him he has 91 pace i know openda is 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 faster if you're looking just at the pace but yeah i don't know what it is for me he is just a really really good striker in this game for so many years so i really like to play with him on the striker possession you can also um switch these guys if you want but for me this is working the best uh the standard formation for this team is the 4-2-2-2 i also uh, use that one but the big problem for me in that formation is Olmo. Olmo is a really great dribbler if you're looking at the stats and at his passing is good uh, but he lacks a bit on pace and in the 4-2-2-2 formation i really like to have faster players as the cams because they are standing a bit on the side of the field so they are playing more like wingers than as uh, attacking midfielders so for me especially for olmo uh, who is a great player for this team uh, i'm using this formation and open on the left side he is amazing Trust me, try it out, he is amazing. Uh, all right, the tactics, pressure on heavy touch, uh, team width 45, the depth is 60. Build a play is long ball, and that is just because of Openda. With the long ball, they're going to make runs into the space behind the opposing back line. That is what it says, and that it 
what it does and especially with openda on this possession with his pace he's making some really really great ones runs but you can't instruct him to get in behind like if he is playing as a real winger because this is a cam possession in this formation but yeah with this tactics he is going to make these runs the same for simons of course he is also pretty fast with 87 so that is the reason why i'm using this tactics and also werner of course with his pace is uh yeah having its benefits for this long ball tactics uh the chance creation for me is on direct passing the width is 45 plays in the box five bars corners free kicks doesn't matter for the tactics but i use two bars for both uh stay back while attacking for the right defender on the instructions center backs default and raum is on balance attack and overlap run so he can go forward he is a really attacking minded uh player and he has the stats and uh, yeah it feels good to have him as an extra option when you are attacking and then you always have three men at the back and simakan is also a center back so if you're playing with these three guys on the back uh, when you lose the ball, it's not that big of a deal and Raum is fast enough to be back really, really quick. We also have Schlager on stay back while attacking. Uh, Kampel is on get forward. Uh, it is sometimes a bit too much maybe because we are already playing long ball. He has high attacking work rate. But for some reason, this was working great for me. So I have him on get in behind, but you can also use balanced if it's a bit too much for you. Um, yeah, Simons is on getting to the box for the cross. Olmo is on free roam. Uh, Openda is on getting to the box for the cross. And then we have Werner. He is on get in behind. All right, this is it for me. The best way to play with his team. Try it out yourself. Let me know in the comments if you tried it out, what your results were and what you think of it. If you had some joy, hopefully you did because that's why I'm making these videos to give you guys some joy playing with these teams and hopefully some wins as well. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. Bye bye.